this is Twit. We're at, were you at both? Was it a two-day developer conference for uh, Project R last week, or was it just Wednesday? It was a two-day, but I have a story for you. I didn't go to the second day, so I actually went to Project RS super sick. Oh. Um, and I feel really terrible about this, and I'm really sorry to whoever gets sick, and I'm really praying to God that Paul Ermeko does not get sick because I was totally in the same room as him and breathing with everybody <laughs> as we were doing the hands-on with the modular smartphone, and I'm just like, don't let anybody know your nose is running. Don't, don't cough. Oh, man, that's... <laughs> <laughs> That's a nightmare was, situation. I, I feel so bad about it, but I have to do my job. Yeah. So, you know what? We all get <laughs> sick. It's the winter. It's just the way it goes. I know. Uh, um, if you if you hadn't done it, somebody else would have. I'm sure so somebody the, else did actually. But so the question is: Were you congested enough to not realize to not note how awesome Project R is, or is am I just reading into it? Is Project R as cool as I hope it is? It's not. You know. Okay. I'm. I might have an unpopular opinion, but I don't think it's, I mean, it doesn't do anything. Like it's just a phone with little blocks in it. It doesn't actually do anything yet. Um, and you know, it, it's still not really a product, but Google's kind of getting there. And it's really interesting because being at this developer conference, like you're surrounded by all these, you, you know, really bright eyed, like intelligent people um there were high schoolers running around uh, running around they'd all like skip school to come to this developers conference you know there were people from all over the world there and they were asking so many questions but a lot of their questions couldn't be answered by google a lot of google statements were just you know uh we'll get back to you on that we'll get back to you on that we're still working on that and it's sort of like it, it it uh, it really gave it really was an example of just how much work still needs to be done on this particular right. project. It's it's so far from from being a thing, and I we still don't know when it's coming to Puerto Rico. Just that it's like they just they had is. a little yeah they had a little roadmap just to kind of tell you that you know between like third and fourth quarter we're hopefully going to go in there. So okay. we'll we'll see. You know, did they let you touch it? So everybody touched it except me because I felt really bad for being sick. <laughs> no, I, 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 I was trying to be a good like person. I put, you know, before being a good journalist. <laughs> so, That's fair enough. Uh, hard to yeah. argue that. So, but they, so from watching the people touching it that were touching it that, that you were not interacting with, did the did the components snap in and out easily? Like, what what was your takeaway from the hardware? Oh, I wanted to compare it to something. And then I, I remembered when I was writing it up, I couldn't think of what to compare it to. But uh, it's a lot like, uh, it kind of snaps like Legos. Like it oh, feels like cool. there's a little bit of resistance when you're trying to like take it off and put it on. Like um, magnetic it, resistance? Because there, there are magnets that kind of hold yeah. the pieces in place, right? Yeah. And you yeah. kind of, you hear that that snapping sound, uh, but then everything just holds together. Um, and I, I actually, now I feel really bad that I, I didn't touch or hold it because... I could give you guys so much more, <laughs> and I would have so much more, but... Just Don't worry about it. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, no, you, no, you, it's hey, you're, you're one step you closer there. to it than we are, you saw it. so it's I fine. I mean, for yeah, us, you, it's still like a Sasquatch. Same, yeah, you know? yeah, exactly. You were in the same room as it. I see saw. <laughs> blurry photos that purport to be real. <laughs> I think uh, the most interesting part of Project Aura, though, is that it's going to open the door for lots of other smartphone technology. And I think that's something that we're sort of forgetting is that as Google's iterating on this and creating modules, they're also trying to think of like, for instance, their big project right now is to work on a battery that's way more efficient than what the OEMs are currently using. Um, so that could eventually Hallelujah. translate to the rest of yeah. our battery tech. And that's, yeah. that's so interesting. I mean, just all the things that are going to come out of this are interesting, but it's still just a tad too early to tell.